welcome back to Blood and Steel, where I have been goofing around. <laughs> like, no joke, just been playing games and killing stuff. First of all, look at this. This is a repeating crossbow. I finally got it from killing some bandits. And it's it's nice, I'll admit that. It's got some, uh, what is it? It's got a magazine of seven. So one, look at this, two, three, four, five, six, and then finally seven. And then you have to reload, but it's instant. It's pretty quick. But it doesn't do that much damage, um, so you have to kind of pull off a lot of headshots with this thing, uh, and be very good with it. I mean, I'm good with guns and crossbows, and you see that the crosshairs aren't quite like you'd think they would be. The accuracy is only 80 on this thing, but it's very quick, just 35 piercing, so it's a decent uh, starting weapon for sure. It's just because of that speed. I mean, if you're in a siege, guys are coming up the ladders and you could pop some heads, it might work, but it's still just a 35 compared to the blunderbuss. Um, well, I might as well try this while I'm in the tavern. <laughs> and I can clearly use weapons in the tavern for some reason. This thing I would not recommend. It's a spear gun. It's a one shot. It's uh, not very accurate. It takes forever to reload. You can't move while reloading, so it's like the handgun. But it's it just it's not very nice. <laughs> I wouldn't recommend it at all. It uh, unless there's something special about it. It only does it does 90 piercing. And you can use it as an actual weapon, so maybe that's the only cool thing about it. Um, but it's just, it takes forever to reload. 15. Speed reload. <laughs> it's insane. So, yeah, Blunderbuss is pretty good. But what else do we do? I got some uh, loot. I decided to keep some things because I remember that eventually, if you want to change your capital, I remember that it was tools and felt. So I decided to keep those two items since we have, you know, 101,800. No. What is this? It's oh my goodness, we're way over that. We're one million eighteen thousand nine hundred twenty. I didn't even realize how much money we had. One million. Oh, it's about to get more too. Cause look at this. So over in the Kajert, Kajert, Kajert area, there's a bunch of these bandits called Rocketeers, and they are probably the best ones I've found really for prisoners. They're worth one thousand three hundred forty-four a pop. So if you can get the trouble is they're in small quantities, and um, um. They're just small quantities, so you have to fight a bunch of guys to get this. I ended up fighting like three or four groups at once to get this amount in one fight. Um, and I also did a little trick in where I found out that by the end of the fight, there was usually only a bunch of rocketeers left because they like to hang back and shoot the whole time. So what I would do is I'd switch my guys to um, blunt weapons, which in fact I found a lot of our guys don't actually use them. Like. I thought for sure that all of these uh, slave chiefs had maces that did bludgeoning damage. No, they're just straight up killing people. <laughs> uh, it does like piercing damage or something because it's just straight up killing them. So I ended up going with melee, like our hired blades and stuff, and they just punched the heck out of these rocketeers, and we were able to catch more that way. Because um, near the end, there was usually like a handful of them just by themselves, so it wasn't dangerous because the rockets aren't that powerful uh, in mass course but not when there's only like five or six guys trying to shoot and uh, the higher blades are just punching them like crazy so that's a little tip right there get these higher blades because look at this boom we're gonna sell those repeating crossbow are okay 179 and then the steep outlaws are okay actually they're worth more than the repeating crossbows I find out now 216 um, and there you go wow we're uh, we're up there now 1,085,917 that's insane I didn't think I'd been going that long. <laughs> Literally, we've been raiding quite a bit, but not as much as usual because we're back where we started. So I only raided, I think, one more place here, and I've only raided actually two places here. But just an update, the uh, swatting have actually taken two, was it castles? No, that's a town. Oh, they're both towns. They've taken two towns from these guys, so that's pretty cool. The bad guys have just recently taken this place, I think. <laughs> In fact, I just noticed that. Oh my goodness. Alright. So we're going to go. And I'm still waiting for my contract to end so that we can go after these guys. But someone mentioned we should maybe like customize our companions, and I've been working on that too. The tricky part is finding armor, to be honest, because those Vagars got very good armor. I mean, look at this. I, I've been dealing with this. The steel plate is 180 and 90. Most of the stuff I find is less than that, so it's hard finding any chest armor that's close to it. 
um, to get him at least some protection. I mean, it's hard to pass up the protection when you got dead guys coming after us. But I'm upgrading the the horses. I've been getting rid of the camels when I can and getting war horses. And I've been getting different war horses. So this guy got one of the skulls and crossbones, which I I kind of like. That's pretty cool. Um, and then what else we got? We've got um, she's got some crazy armor. I got some of that samurai Ronin uh, helmet and gloves. I found this. I don't know where it is. It, Kinda looks nice, um, and then some people still have to get level four for riding for the war horses. This guy got scorpions on his. Figure he got the poisonous bow, might as well. He's crazy like that. And then we got a Nord horse here with this lady because she's kind of tough. And we got our foot soldiers. I got this lady some armor, uh, some more horses. Alan's got his horse. It's a Mameluk actually. It's pretty beastly. Um, he's got a horse. I'm going to upgrade some more of these people. I decided to make this guy completely gold. Just because, why not? <laughs> and then Ymir, I've actually been upgrading. She got some cool armor, too. Um, but we're upgrading friends and stuff. So, yeah, it's working pretty good. We got all of our troops. We haven't been really losing anything. But now I'm kind of curious to go back here now that that is plain taken. And I want to check out to see what they reinforce this with. So, in fact, we're going to go through this area. Because I just taken out a bunch of bandits. They actually kind of were chasing me earlier. I hope they just bugger off because I don't want to fight them right now. Do away. Did you not just see me? I destroyed like 900. They're not that bad. <laughs> Once you get the troops, these guys aren't too bad at all. The rocketeers just don't do much damage to your elite infantry when they're just pummeling them to death. <laughs> I shouldn't say to death. But knocking their butts out. Alright. Oh wow. They reinforced with a thousand troops. See, I'm kind of trying to figure out an idea of what would happen if say oh there's some bad people here oh undead scouts I think we'll go after them um, like say we went and took a place and we had a bail on it like if they took it back how bad would they reinforce it maybe uh, I don't know if I can even, even catch these guys 3.6 maybe Let's sneak through the forest here I feel like we can take that death knight skeleton riders skeletons aren't as bad as those Death Knight other thingies. I mean, Death Knights are Death Knights. I don't know. I don't remember what they were called. Come on. Let's catch these guys. I want to see if we can get some more super weapons. <laughs> Things that go and just insta-kill people would be fun. Come on. Wait for daytime. Wait for daytime, man. Boom. We got you, Bones. Okay. We got 92. It's not too bad. We got 409. Those Ronin are super good. Like, I've hardly lost any, and they're still kicking butt. Oh, and I fixed our horses. So what you have to do is make your horses go into uh, the horse group 2. For some reason, it fixed it. Like, I was trying it with one fight, and I noticed that only some of them were actually listening to me. Like, the Ronin were listening, but the slavers weren't. And so now I have to click 9, which is way over there, but it works. And now I can tell them to do stuff. We can do flanks. All this fun stuff. Archers, I want you to hold this hill right here. Bodyguards, I want you to go up there. All of our bodyguards are pretty much anyone that's on horse or on foot that's a companion. Because they're beastly. We might as well have them backing us up. I'm going to fire into that group. And now I just hit 9 instead of 3. We can tell all, all those guys to charge. And look, they actually do it. So I don't know why. I just noticed one day, I was like, why is it only these guys standing around? Like the Ronin were completely listening to me. But for some reason... Ouch. No. Um, some of them weren't, so... I tried it and it worked. Okay, these guys don't have super weapons, but the remnants do. Not only are they super, but they're expensive. Nice. Yeah, these skeletons are pretty much just like slightly tougher bandits. I feel. They're not too OP. Look at them. They're working together. It's amazing. I was almost afraid I'd have to get rid of a bunch of them. Just so I'd have to uh, actually have my horsemen working, but I fixed it. Where are you guys going after? Oh, there's like one guy over here. Boosh. Slavery Chief took out two right there. Wow. Okay. Done. Casualties, we lost seven, one wounded. Actually, <laughs> I had a weird thing show up where two of our friends died. It said their names killed. <laughs> I'm like, what? Our friends can't die. Right? Okay. Uh upgrade to you guys later. 
Let's upgrade some troops. Dun, 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 dun. Now that I got those guys working, I can start upgrading more of those. And watchmen. Okay. Done. Four items. Yeah, see, they don't have the best armor. Uh, oh, they got spears. Ooh, a skeleton horse, though. That would be different. <laughs> it's not the best looking. Let's compare its stats. Let's see. Who would want... Oh, maybe you? What's the riding skill required for it? Only two. I could actually give this to our horse archer. It's got 45 armor, so not very good armor. Decent speed compared to a camel, but camels are pretty slow. Maneuverability is decent. It's 45. Charge value is low. And it only got 100 health. Never mind. It's not very good. It looks cool, but I think I would pass on that. Alright, so no cool weapons from the remnants. I was kind of hoping those. Alright, let's go to Hallmar. I'm after to restock on some food real quick. Uh, we'll check out to see how much they reinforced and what they reinforced too. That's another key thing. Like if they put a bunch of skeletons in it, that would be pretty good. But if they put a bunch of those nasty things in there, like they have those other towns, I don't think so. I don't know how the heck you would siege that. Just lots and lots of range weapons probably. Like that's the only thing I could think of that could maybe do it. Because they'd be stuck on the walls. I don't know how well their ranged troops are. But they'd be kind of cluttered up there. Oh, that's an option. Like a bunch of hand gunners and stuff would go up there. That would work. Uh, hand gunners and whatnots. Okay, what else do we got here? Do, 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 do. I can get rid of... I'm definitely going to get rid of these. They're just not worth it. They're not very good. Uh, get rid of that. Uh, keeping that. Swatting a heater shield. I get rid of that. We got shields. Um, anything cool here? Uh, no. Masterwork Warhammer. Wow. 65 piercing. 35 piercing for the thrust. 120 speed and that's actually pretty cool. I might take that. Give it that to somebody. Uh, I got plenty of toys. <laughs> Too many toys. And then we'll go to the armor. Get rid of that. Anything here? Ooh. That's cool. And it's decent, too. 230. And then 215. It says 225. Ooh. That's cool. And it's different. See, we're doing it. Custom I see this is what I'm talking about. Steel plate, 180 and 90. Everything else I find is like 160, 150. It's very hard to find anything better than that steel plate from those guys, which is crazy. Um But we're gonna have to just do it. We're gonna have to get some of this stuff. Like I kinda like We got so much money. We might as well splurge a little here. Because I'm not going after Swadian, so we're not going to be getting that. I need boots, too, then. And gauntlets. We could get some of these. Going shopping, guys. <laughs> and then... That's probably it. And then... What does this even do? 160 for a sister's mask. Alright, see, boots is another thing. I'm hardly, hardly ever finding any good boots for them, too. Alright, I'm not going to spend that much money, but it's worth it. We gotta look stylish. Marketplace. Nope, I want tavern, I mean. Pop in here real quick. Did I already pop in here? I did. Never mind. Bam. Alright, let me upgrade our friends. Get rid of some stuff. Swap out their gear. And then we're going to see what this town has. And see how many more people. We only saw the one. But I'm cur curious to see if any more show up. Okay. I got here. It ends up the bad guys got Aleph too. <laughs> like, I went back here. And they got actually a variety of troops in this one. Um... I didn't even think about looking at the troops themselves, what they had in there, but there's a big variety of troops garrisoned here. And then there's an A lift too. So every time they take a place, I guess they get a garrison for an A lift. And then there's a Baron von Death in here. <laughs> but he got defeated somehow. I don't know what he had before, or maybe he's just spawning in and he's going to recruit. But there's 1,330 troops. And there's an A lift in there. Um, it could be the A lift for the Baron, actually. I don't know, I got 0 or 1. I think it's just the Baron himself. There's 51 Soul Counter Champions. There's 300 Death Knights. There's 300 Smashers. 300 Blade Masters. 3 Intruders. And 78 Gums. So they do reinforce with the heavy guys. Not skeletons, but the heavy guys. So you would definitely need a lot of, like, siege guns to just bombard them before you even try taking the walls. Otherwise, you're just going to get destroyed coming up a ladder or something. But that's insane. There's actually some fighting going on. I'm kind of curious to see what it is. Because they've taken this place. 
I just don't know where... Oh, there we go. Running for the Holy Army. Uh, the Dark Horde. <laughs> There's 556 out of 847. There's a bunch of Serenids in there. They even are using some of their prisoners for troops, but there's still seven counter or soul counter champions, um, 18 death knights, 152 smashers, 94 blade masters, 116 shooters, 148 sirens, which I have not seen. I have seen some weapons. Where did the holy army go? Oh, there they are. That's a lot of dudes still. 1,205. Okay. Taken from the kingdom of Rodox. Oh, they just took that place. Okay. So these guys, I don't know if they actually go after territory. They're going after that army. Oh, I feel like jumping in that, to be honest. Let's see how well they do. And it's nighttime, too, so let's wait to see. Let's not get too close. Okay. Like, I mean, think about it. The loots that we could get from this one army if we jump in there at the last second to help them. We have tons of troops. I can get more troops. That's no issue. We have the money to buy them. We have nothing else to do while I'm waiting to see if my mercenary contract will end here. Let's upgrade a few more people real quick. But I'm kind of curious. Oh, yeah, they're doing really good. They're doing really good. They don't even have an a -lift. Oh, wait, do they do? I didn't notice it before, I guess. Alright. Hmm. I think we'll let them get down a little bit closer. That's still a lot of guys in there. And they're only knocking out like 800 or so at a time. Okay, that's a little bit better. There's a lot of prisoners, but we can't take them really. Alright, I think we're going to jump in here. Let's see how this goes. Um, rush to the aid of the dark. Oh, uh, we could get happy points this way, too, without having to go after the villagers, I think. I think I'd like that a little bit more, but I think as soon as you get happy points with the bad guys, the good guys will get negative points. Um, move in to help the Holy Army. Okay. Charge the enemy. I have an Aleph, so we can use it if we need to. But these guys are pretty tough. All these Templar Knights and stuff. But let's see if we can do it. I mean, we got a lot of troops. How many troops do we have? We've got... Oh, I got 106 and they got 96. Interesting. All right. They didn't. Oh, they didn't bring the Aleph out. All right, that's not too great. Okay, they're all in the corner. And well, charging head. All right, let's go ahead. How many archers do I got? I got 21 archers. All right, that's decent. Let's see. Oh, they're starting to break formations now. If maybe we could use this hill for a flanking maneuver. Because they're so scattered, like their horsemen are just standing there. This could have been a bad idea. If the AI isn't as good on the field as it is. Oh, look at that. Alright, guys. Get right there. Use that hill for cover. Uh, you guys go stand over there. Bodyguards go stand over here. I'm gonna go poke the bear a little bit. I don't know. We might have to actually like pull back after this one and then... Oh, here comes a guy. You want some? What are you? Oh, you must be like the champion. Because you just took that like a boss and you've got a cool helmet. Oh, yep, you definitely gotta be the champion. So these are the soul counter champions. Why do you got a, why do you got a lance? Did you get off your horses? Holy cow! Well, he just took me out. 50. My horse took 55. I took 41. That was with a lance, guys. Lances don't do that much usually, unless you get right up in them. Alright, at least I positioned our guys so they're gonna charge. They took one out. Hired Blade took one out. That was nuts. That was nuts. He poked me with that lance, and I just got knocked out. <laughs> Alright, there's all the mashers and stuff. Blades masters, smashers. Oh my goodness. They're getting knocked out, which is great. Here comes the paragons over there. Okay. Got a lot of... Well, we got some range, guys. Luckily we took out that group. 
Wow. I wasn't expecting him to get me with that lance. <laughs> I was gonna poke fun at him. Like, lances usually don't do that. And then he just like, what? He shish kebabbed me. Literally, he shish kebabbed me right there. Oh man, there's so many of them though. They are just chewing up these guys. I don't know why they're. I guess the numbers. I should have not jumped in until the very end. We should have waited until there's like 200, maybe 100. Look at them. They just destroyed everybody. Our guys got some levels though, so that's good. <laughs> Templars are still going. Oh my goodness, so. That was nuts. These things are nasty. So the soul champions, I think, are the, they're actually on horses, but I think that's maybe oh, this camera. Um, I think they got stuck in that corner. It looked like, and they may have got off their horses for some reason. They were super quick though if they got up in front of all of those guys. What are these? Oh, these are their shooters. What kind of guns do the shooters got? They look like Giselles, maybe. Flintlocks? Some, no, they look like Giselles. They got those fancy shields I got. Alright. Oh, they got guns, too. They got pistols and rifles. Wow. The companions carry away in the fight. Wow. He was finally knocked out. Our friend made it to the last. That's insane. We lost seven and one wound. Um, enemies lost uh, 92. Um, there's still 906 versus... We're going to pull out. Because we need to heal up. Because I can't do anything. Look at that. They literally just knocked us out. That's another thing I've noticed. Usually after you get knocked out in a fight. You have like. I don't know. 50. 70 some of your health. And you can go another round. And then usually you can go one more. And then you're completely knocked out of health. And you can't jump in. But this one. They completely take away all your health. Let's see how many levels our friends got real quick. Um, You had that crazy bow. You got two. That's not bad. Let's go ahead and do your strength. Do your toughness. I need to do more one-handed for you because you got, I think, some weapon. I usually give one-handed. Um, I think we're gonna work on the agility though. So you have faster horse riding. You already have seven. Shoot, that won't work. All right, let's think this. Seven's pretty high. I'd have to get it way up there just to get it any more than that. All right, let's do that. And maybe let's do your combat training. All I need is one more point there. So just that. And then we'll do your looting since you're kind of the looter. I do pathfinding for giggles one handed. Alright, I like that better. Alright, and then we go to do. You. you got one level. And again, we're going to do this because we need to give you four in riding so we can give you a war horse instead of the camel. And then uh, you got guns and one handed. I need to do more weapon master next time. I got a lot of points built up for you. Oh, let's give you that horse. Oh, shoot. I left. Um, gosh, these guys have so many names. <laughs> was it you? Pretty sure it was you. All right, here, have a war horse. Let's look more professional. <laughs> the camels are fun, but let's look professional. And then let's get this guy. You leveled up five times because you're just a beast like that. Let's get you up to that, and then we can do another into toughness. <laughs> I can do Weapon Master. That didn't do any good. You got insane melee skills. Let's just bump that up then. Um, I'm thinking Intelligence. But I don't know what I'm going to do with all those points, so... Let's do... Charisma. Agility. I can make you super quick. You already got five reflexes, though. Oh my gosh, the choices. Let's do charisma. Let's get that into your heroism. And let's go ahead and do this. Um, let's go into spotting. There we go, done, done. And then everyone else that was with us got knocked out and I don't think they leveled up. And we're gonna chill. We're gonna chill and see what happens with these guys. I think I'm gonna go actually chill in this castle for a little bit. I'm gonna let these guys duke it out a little bit more. I feel like they can do it. Like there's only 257 left. So we'll let them duke it out a little bit. Actually I'll just wait. And then next time, actually do we have time? Let's pause that. Let's think about this. I think we can. Let me pause. Let's heal up a little bit and then I think we can wait and just go a little longer in this episode. And get some nice loot. I want the loots. Okay, that went way quicker than I was expecting. I'll say it dropped down to 90. 
I don't, we better jump in there. I think we can take 90. I think we can. Let's help. Um, oh, I actually can't use my Aleph. I thought I could. I thought one of these was the Aleph one. I think if I was by myself, I could. I'm surprised they didn't have theirs. Alright, let's do this. 90. I'm not going to at least regenerate. Like, it's been so quick. Look at my health. There was only, like, a little sliver still. Still no Aleph? Oh, my goodness. Alright. Let's see what we have. We have 27 archers. 29. Alright. We have so many horsemen. There's a giant heel right here. I feel like... We should work together. They're actually charging in, so let's work together. Let's go for this hill. Put our archers up there. Because they're pretty slow. They're going to probably be the last thing to get up on this hill. So they might as well hold that. We'll send everyone else. Who are you? Sisters of Mercy. Ah, okay. I don't know if I've seen you before. Okay. Set these guys up. Archers there. Friends, go have some fun. Horsemen go in there as well. Infantry go into there as well, and everybody else will hold up on that hill right there. Do some do Oh, there's on horses. Alright, let's go ahead and use our horse, and let's go after these guys. Try not to get knocked out. Come here. Boomstick. Woohoo! <laughs> Drasmus, I thank you. Thank you for the assist. Okay. I think booming sticks this guy is going to help. There we go, I got him. Death Knight, holy. Oh, actually, I got two Death Knights in that one. What's this? Oh, I bet you're Sirens. See, there's shooters and then there's the Sirens. Nice. Yep, I got a Siren, okay. So there's female warriors as well on their side. Ah, dang it, he took that with that shield. Okay. Dang it, missed. Oh, shoot. I hit the Ronin. Got him. Death Knight. Alright. We're doing it, guys. We're doing it. Got her. Wow. Oh, okay. It's big guys left. Try to assist with those. I don't think there's any horsemen left. Oh, my goodness. Nice work. Okay. Where's the last one? Oh, there's one right here. Get away, my whore! Get away! Aha! Sneak attack, last one. <laughs> oh, and I knocked her out, too, with my horse. 35. <laughs> nice. Very, very nice. Alright. Our casualties, we lost 22, 18. Allies lost 24 and 18. And enemies, 82 and 8 were wounded. Wow. Okay. Um, so we did get happy points with the Army of Light. We got 4 uh, points. We got 1 point relationship with this guy. We didn't capture anyone. Um, none of our friends leveled up, but we got troops ready to upgrade again. Let's get some more of these guys. I think that was the only ones that leveled up. Everyone else... He's already leveled up. Oh, yeah. Oh. Oh. We get red spiked armor. Let's go for the red spiked armor. I like that. And then... <laughs> this is a little dinky axe. 66 weapon range. 125 speed. And it's got 100 cutting. That's cool. It's... um. It can crush through blocks, too. That's weird. Ancients, 5. And it can one-shot people. Oh, okay, this is what they had. Arborisk. Darkly, uh, dark gauntlets. We can use those. Ah, nice. More boots. Ah, that's it. I was hoping for a few more things, but I guess we took only 90 people out, so that's to be expected. But we got some nice new armor. The red. It looks pretty cool. And we got some more spiked armor for some more friends of ours. And we did it. We took out the horde. Give these guys a little respect. Mainly I did that because I wanted some gear. Secondly, I wanted to see how well these guys would handle themselves, and they're doing pretty well. They're going to run out of troops, though, but I imagine he'd restock and just come back. And A, I kind of wanted to, you know, make sure that guy took them out so that, um, um, and kind of tied these guys back. I feel like that'll help these guys, uh, slow their race until, or, you know, slow the pace down until they, uh, we can get our own faction going. But there we go, guys. Intense. And I was you. Actually, can I go in here? 
I will see you next time, but let's really quickly see if I can actually, like, walk in here. Can I go into this place? I can sneak in. I can besiege it. No. I can approach the gates. We will not try to sneak in that. I have yet to try it in this mod, but <laughs> sometimes it don't work. And I will see you next time. Bye.